Good day, folks. Hey, I just want to take a real quick moment to talk about how you know that you're on the right path and how you know that you're doing the right things in your life. Yeah, I work for a, uh, a global company. The company is called Millicron. Um, Cincinnati Millicron is what it used to be. Uh, they've changed quite a bit over the years, but they're a global company. We've got uh, plants on every continent in the world. Uh, I think their, their average net worth or their average profit is somewhere around $74 million in a year. Um, so it's a pretty large organization. Um, I had a meeting yesterday, a lunch meeting, with our continuous improvement guy for, for the global network, for our global company. Um, so he travels all over to every plant and makes sure that everybody is continuing to improve. He tries to put systems into place so that we're not you know, trying to recreate the wheel and stuff like that. And I had a lunch meeting with this guy, and he just asked me straight up, he's like, so what's your plan, man? He's like, what do, what do you want out of life? What is it that you're doing? And I kind of laid out my 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 plan to him. And in all honesty, my plan is to replace my income from Millicron by the year 2020. And I told him, I said, I said I don't plan on on working for Millicron my entire life. I said I want to be retired. Uh, well, not retired. I consider it job optional because uh, in our economy, retired means that you're about ready to die or to go broke or to have a a major life crisis. Um, but in my eyes, it's it's job optional. I told him, I said, I plan to be job optional by 2020. I said, I'm going to replace my income, have multiple streams of income. Uh, I plan to have um, basically a, my own nest egg of, of residual income coming in so that by 2020, I can do what I want to do with my life and uh, yeah, just plan it out the way I want. And by the time I laid out my plan, he just kind of looked at me. He's like, dude, he's like, that's awesome. Now this is a, a continuous improvement guy for a $74 million global company. And he's telling me, dude, you're on the right path. He's telling me like, dude, you, you've got everything laid out. He's like, you, you know exactly what it is that you want. You defined exactly the number that you have to have. You've got a plan laid out. You've already taken the, the steps to get the foundation laid. Now it's just a matter of putting it all together. And, and that really spoke volumes to me, knowing that this guy really knows his stuff. He knows what he's doing. And, you know, here he is, he's a, he's a big wig at this company, but yet he's telling me that I've, I'm on the right path. So I just want to relate to you guys, get your, get your stuff laid out, sit down with a pen and paper and figure out what it is that you want. Um, don't, don't be afraid to put it on paper. That's the number one thing, getting it out of here and, and written down. I mean, that is, that is, that takes it from the abstract and puts it on the concrete. Um, it's direly important to make sure that you have it written down so that you can see it every single day. Put it in front of you so you don't forget it. Uh, it's easy to get caught up in life and forget what it is that you actually want, but when it's written down, it's it's there. You just you see it every day. You can't forget it. So get your life laid out. Figure out what it is that you want. Get yourself a plan in place. If you don't know what it is that you want, I recommend getting around people that have the, the results that you want and find out what they did. Um, get you some mentors. Find some people to learn from. And for the love of all things holy, take action in your life. Start putting things into place. Start taking steps. Don't be afraid to get out of your comfort zone and just do what it's necessary. Do what it takes. Um, whether it's talking to people that you've never talked to or whether it's, you know, taking a leap of faith into a business that you've never heard of or, or something. I mean, you know, I know people that quit their jobs making 40, 50 grand a year and spend months making no income whatsoever to try to get, you know, businesses off the ground but in the long run it puts urgency in their life and they do what they have to do because they have to do it so love you guys as always hope you guys love the information if you need anything at all please leave comments at the bottom I'm, I'm, I'd love to, to be able to chit chat with you guys about you know what's going on in your lives um, like and share if you don't mind please and uh, I'd love it if you'd subscribe have a wonderful day and God bless